All right, look, it's something that we hope to avoid, but the reality is it happens. We're talking about infidelity and in relationships. Relationship expert Dr. Tammy Nelson is joining us now. And Dr. Nelson, you have a new book called When You're the One Who Cheats. Can you first please tell us briefly what this book is about? Sure. Well, When You're the One Who Cheats is about the perspective of the cheater and how to make decisions based on what you really want, what you really should do, and how to heal your relationships, whether it's with the person that you're cheating with or the person you want to end up with. You know, it's really rare to focus on the cheater. We usually have a lot of uh, books out there and a lot of articles focused on the victim of the person, uh, the victim of the affair, the person who's been cheated on, but there's not a lot written for the person who's cheated. And so why do you think that the topics that are in your book are so important? You know, I think in order to focus on the truth and integrity, it's really important to focus on the person who's having the affair. Because people who cheat are not necessarily waking up every day going, well, let me see how I can be like a bad person today. Everybody wants to have a relationship and everyone's looking for the same thing. And I think it's really important to help people make some decisions based on integrity, like how to end their affair with integrity, how to make decisions based on their relationships going forward if they choose to stay with their spouse. And I found a lot of information out there around what it means to be in an affair that I think everybody needs to know. What are the main messages that you want people to take away, whether they're the ones that were cheated on or that were doing the cheating from your book? Well, you know, I found some really interesting information when I talked to people who were cheating on dating websites like Ashley Madison, where people go on specifically to find someone to cheat with. And what I realized is that men and women cheat for different reasons. One, women cheat for sex and men cheat for relationships, which is the opposite of what we think of when we think of affairs. Right. And that a lot of people cheat. <laughs> <laughs> and considering there's almost 15,000 people that sign up daily for websites like Ashley Madison, which is a cheating website, I think that we have to be really honest about what's happening in marriage. And that marriages are difficult and it's really hard to stay monogamous for a really long period of time. And we're expected to stay married now for 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, sometimes 70 years and be desirous of one person. And I think that we need to learn new ways to talk about monogamy and to negotiate monogamy in ways that work. And when we don't do it well, to repair from affairs in new and exciting ways that can be passionate and more alive. Got it, this is also very interesting. So where can our viewers go to find some more information about your book? Uh, they can buy the book when you're the one who cheats on Amazon, but they can also go to my website, Dr. Tammy Nelson, and find out all kinds of ways to either heal from their affair or ask me questions about what to do if you're the one who cheats. Perfect. Well, thank you so much, Dr. Nelson, for joining us. And we're going to post this segment on our website, firstcoastliving.net.